In this video we're going to be looking at a radioactive substance that decays using the formula Wt is equal to W0 times 5 to the power of negative 0.002t. So we're going to find the initial mass. Now initial means the beginning, the start. So initial means when t equals 0. Alright, now if t equals 0, that means that power, that's, that means this t here is 0. So that means 5 to the power of 0, which is 1. So that means the initial w0 is equal to w0, that's the initial. Alright, so that's the initial weight, so b. But I wanted to find the weight after 100 years, so that's T equals 100 years. So it'd be WT is equal to W0. Oh, that T, we could rewrite that as 100 times 5 to the power of negative 0.0. .0 0, 2 times 100. Now we know it's decaying. One, because I said it was radioactive. But a good way to check is you always look at the power. If that's a negative, like it is here, that means it's decaying. That means we're losing mass. Which is equal to W0 times... So W2, that's a 5 to the power of negative 0 0.2 because we've times it by 100 which equals W0 and this is approximately times 0 0.687 which means as a percentage that would be 68% so that's 68.7% of W0. Okay, because it's a fraction, we put it into a percentage, we get 68%. So that's 0.68 of the original mass. So if this was just say T is 600 years, 600, so after 600 years, what mass we had, it would be W600 is equal to. W0 times negative 5, well not negative 5, sorry, what am I doing? It's 5 to the power of negative 0 0.002 times 600. So you put that in your calculator and you're going to end up with W0 times... 0.0867 approximately which equals it's about 8.67% of W0 because it's as a decimal we can convert that to a percentage so we know now from there we can graph this now graphing is not too bad because We've got time. Time is our independent variable. So time will be on our x-axis. And we've got weight on our y. All right. Now, use a scale. We've got 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600. So it's years. And we've got percentage, we've got 100%, 50%, and so on. So our initial weight was 100. Our, after 100 years, it was 68%, so that's approximately here, because it's only a sketch. And after 600 years, about just under 10%, so we're looking around here. So there's our dots, and we can just join up our dots with a decay, as you can see, it's decaying because it's got a negative power as well. So it's a, looking at the power and looking at the question quickly, we can get an idea 
of what type of graph we're going to be looking at when we're finished. Thank you.